A pleasure to meet y'all at last, and welcome back to Nerf Secrets Revealed. So currently, there's probably not going to be much that I'm going to want to talk about today, that is. But I feel like that what I've got right now is that there are going to be a few more subjects I'm going to go on ahead and just disclose. Just so I can get it over with for the most part. So... Subject number one that I'm pretty much applying here to this season is that I'm wanting to find out if Hasbro has any more plans, really, to go and partner up with certain video game producers out there. Because after all, ever since the release of Nerf and Strike, as in the game that was released on Nintendo Wii back in 2008, and then with another one from 2010... We haven't seen that much of official Nerf video games that would be released out on game consoles out there. We've hardly seen any on Xbox or PlayStation or even the brand new Google Stadia. But in any case, I would really want to see if Hasbro could do anything about simply putting up any more video games towards any consoles that exist. If there's any out there that can go on some things like the Nintendo Switch or anything out there at all, then it would blow any of our minds. Any of us super fans out there of Hasbro's Nerf lineup of Toy Blasters and out there, we've got a lot more than just the Blasters themselves. So this just all, in turn, ties up to what makes Nerf itself one of the biggest brands of Toy Blasters out there. Of course, other brands out there, including Dart Zone, Busby, Exploders, and of course those spitball guns out there, which aren't exactly as popular as they were 10 years ago, but of course they've really had their share of the glory. They've had their share of the take when it comes to really being well known. But out of all of them, Nerf seems to really hold the crown. And I can tell you, that's probably something that's going to be stuck here for a while. But now, I feel like that at this time, with more things coming around that are Nerf related, it would be about time that Nerf and Hasbro simply got together and really expanded Horizons in any ways. If Hasbro ever made themselves an actual Nerf vehicle out there that would simply be made for anyone to drive, then it would be another thing out there. It would be another achievement. Because after all, Domino's has made a car of their own, specifically for delivering pizzas and keeping them hot. But if Nerf ever had their own car out there that would be official to drive out there, it would be something, really something, for anybody out there who would be willing to try it out for themselves. But, again, these are endeavors that are probably not going to be anything for a long time. But, it's still pretty nice to actually think about what concepts out there lie within the Nerf brand itself. But the lineup of blasters will also continue to grow exponentially. After all, there are thousands of blasters out there that anybody can get their hands on today. If they went online and pretty much just bought some that are rare, then, well, it's another big story. Because the exact number of Nerf Blasters that will exist in our lifetimes will vary. Because, of course, I still have got my fair share of really large amounts of Nerf Blasters in my collection at all. But, of course, the reason how it just continues to decline is because of how, well... Of course, I can't really seem to keep them all together with me. But I guess it's probably something I can ignore at the moment. But anyways, I'm just going to go back on to what I've been saying before about the fact that at some point, Nerf and Hasbro should come together with anyone else out there. Any company out there that would really produce a video game specifically tailored for Nerf superfans out there like myself. Because after all, when we had ourselves the Nintendo Wii game from 2008, or the Wii game from 2010, they were both pretty darn awesome. And best of all, there was a special edition pack that you can get that included a free Switch Shot blaster with a red holographic sight that would be used 
for any secrets that you can find in the game. But any point from this moment on that Nerf could have themselves another video game tailored for today's lineup of consoles, which includes the PlayStation 4, the Xbox One, the Nintendo Switch, and who could forget the brand new Google Stadia? Because Stadia, of course, does have its share of, well, concepts of how it becomes its very own console that is going to be really, really big some point. But I guess for now, though, that's probably something we can leave alone. But anyhow, though, I feel like that uh, two more subjects of mine are going to need to be disclosed out. But since I don't have as much time, well, to get every single episode up and running, there's just not much that I've got left to take in. But as soon as I can get even more ideas out, and therefore I'm able to have more episodes made in a certain period of time, then of course I will let anyone else know about how it's all going to go down. I'm hoping that the season is going to be as big as I've made Season 6 big. Season 7, I'm really hoping to have a lot more done with this one because of how it's going to have a larger episode count on it. And the fact that, well, there's going to be even more subjects that I will be talking about at some point. But now, I really would just want to say that I've really come so far. And I'm absolutely stunned at how well I have seem to be doing at my work here. My work here really is turning out superb. Thanks to the fact that, well, I discovered the best kind of quality enhancements, the base frame ratio, and other unique uses out there that I can put together with the software that I specifically use to create all my episodes. And now, since I've gotten this far, there's going to be a lot that I would want to take in. But now, I would basically want to move on to the other two subjects and two other episodes of mine that I will have later on. So, if you want to see more, go down to my channel. Make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.